But yeah, that was that was by far the worst job I have ever worked at. Mm -hmm. Like the worst. And I'm glad I worked there. I I'm I'm glad I worked there because nothing has topped that place as the worst place I've ever worked at. Fair enough, yeah. <laughs> nothing has topped it. You know, I've I've went, I've worked at plenty of warehouses. I worked at plenty of jobs. That is still the worst place I ever worked at. Yeah. It was a fucking night. And you know, and what's sad is that that place was so dangerous. You had to get along with everyone because we literally had to look out for each other. Right. Because that's how dangerous the place was. So yeah. It, yeah so I'm I'm glad I stopped working there because that place was a fucking nightmare. What was the worst place you ever worked at? <laughs> uh, I mean, it was uh, the refrigerator warehouse. Remember? Refrigerator warehouse. Oh, yeah. Like, it was not Appliance Mart? It was like a warehouse at Appliance Mart or something no, like that? I have no idea. All I know is I had to get, I had to jack up uh, fr fr fridges and oh, move them from one spot to another. And, and, it would, yeah. and then, and then oh, me and you would like spend like hours throwing cardboard in the compactor? Yeah. Yeah. I remember that place. It was the worst place ever because there was never any cleaning. Yeah, there was like no, the whole area. The whole place was, was dirty so as hell. Fucking dirty yeah. and dusty. It was dirty as hell. It was dusty. We, you know, we didn't know what the hell we were doing half the time and everything. The radio was nothing but country and classic it rock. Was, oh god, it was, yeah. Acting chief engineer. Ugh. Yeah, and um, and then they just fired us because they thought we were being lazy. And I'm like, you didn't tell us to do anything. Right. Yeah. You know, <laughs> like it's like whatever. Oh yeah, now is the place where I got that phone call from my ex. Yeah. I forgot about that. I don't yeah. think I should talk about that. No, but yeah. you shouldn't. Yeah, but that's where I got that phone call. Yeah, that was a, that was a fun. Wait, right here. Okay. Yeah, that was a fun time. All right, what's this? I have not been paying attention to the news story that's been given to me, but seeing you in the control it's room. Not a news story. Any news on the engines? Yeah, but it makes no sense. They're out of fuel. The centrifuge is offline. We're tethered to a four trillion ton payload. Without the engines. It's dragging us down to the planet. Can you handle it alone? Sure. Fix the centrifuge, get the fuel running, then do a full restart. But you'll need to stabilize our orbit from there. Standing by. Fast as you can, Isaac. Okay then, so I'm on my own. Don't they have crews for shit like this? Like engineering crews? Well, I'm pretty sure everyone's uh, all, uh, dead right now. No, even for backup. Wouldn't I have, like, a partner with me or something? It was a small team. For a big-ass ship like this? Well, like, they... I, I'm, I'm just saying, it's just such plot convenience to make it a single-player game. To be fair, you know I, mean? they were, like, I don't think they were expecting zombies. That's true. They're probably expecting the ship to be, you know, solely, you know, completely populated. In a bit. <gasps> the Ripper! I forgot about this thing. There's a weird looking gun. Oh, do you not know what it does? Right. You got hockey, remember? Right. You don't know what it does? No, I'm assuming it shoots discs. Oh. Interesting. Yeah. Really interesting. I mean, a lot of people love this thing. I thought it was fucking useless at some point. But I'll use it in case, I mean, in case for a backup or something to sell. Reminds me of the bus on Metal Arms. Security request. Richard. Oh, the Ripper? Yeah, the Ripper. Wait, ain't that what this called? Devers, get those wires off. Tell to shut out. I don't want yeah, to. Yeah, it's called the Ripper. I don't huh. want to. Christ, Henderson, get your teeth. Get your teeth out. Just hold it. Where the fuck is security? I guess the piping's broke. Oh, he was pulling his teeth out, right. I remember that day. When you were pulling your teeth out? No, when I when he was pulling his teeth. It was a horrifying day. Oh. <laughs> oh, you were there. Yeah. Oh, Jesus! What were you doing when Henderson pulled his teeth? <laughs> I was watching the news when 9-11 happened. I was ironically at the dentist. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, that was, that's also a really interesting story I have. You, hello. Where I talked uh, about. Hi, bitch. Dr. Nicole Brennan. 
You are not Nicole. Why is this ugly too? It's a hologram. Holograms don't look that ugly. Subject was dismembered after falling into machinery, allowing. God. So sorry. Postmortem spasms. Sure. He was twitching because he's got my axe embedded into his nervous Just system. The yellow vial seen in other specimens. I've seen this vial react to dead or bioprosthetic cells. The dead tissue is absorbed, recombined, then reanimated. Do I have to watch this? I don't think I have to watch this. Human you know, for a remake, I would have preferred calling this a remaster, honestly. Yeah. Because, like, it is the exact same story, just with added stuff. And it's basically even the same dialogue. The only thing different is that, is that uh, Isaac can talk in this one. Right. God, this is dark. This, there's so much I would consider, like, for a modern game. Hi, uh, buddy. Did EA? Was EA still EA. involved in this game? Oh, no, yeah, EA did make this, yeah. The remake? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because that's disappointing. Why? Have you seen all the sports games and how realistic those look? And Call of Duty. Yeah. Yeah, that's this true. This is very disappointing in comparison. That's true, yeah. The recent Call of Duty game looks fucking fantastic. Yeah. It's hard to call this a remake when that remake looks fucking amazing. Right. Dude, for the team, for Call of Duty has a lot more people involved. Yeah. <laughs> he jumped in the air. Oh, Yippee! I don't need that. I need to find a store Morning. so I can sell this stuff. Fuel preserves depleted. Main engines offline. Contact engineering. You're oh. all going to die down here. <laughs> I think the movie would have been so much more fun what if movie? that if the what, red, what if the movie? Red Queen was just aggressively British. Oh, the Resident Evil. Oh, you're all going to die down here. Yes, sons of bitches. <laughs> you're daft cunt. Yeah. I have to find upgrades, yeah, yeah. not why just the nodes. The, I was like, why do you think the rotate rotating uh, the uh, the target system was so slow? Well, no, in the original game, it was only the power nodes you needed. I didn't realize you had to find items too. Quit bitching and play the game. I'm not bitching. I'm I'm I'm, I'm surprised. Fuck my asshole. <laughs> Fuck my asshole. Into something beautiful. They're gonna poke me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> that fell a lot better than I thought it would. What have they done to me? Oh, I went back to the other outfit. Oh, okay. I guess you can't have the uh, the new. Icky. I, I, I guess we can't have the original outfit upgraded. Okay, whatever. Cool. Let's get more ammo. Is that why you were dying so easily? Because the armor sucks? Probably. Oh, cool. Then you can change the uh, difficulty now. No! Woo! Okay, so I gotta go that way. Okay. Refill the engine. So oh, right, I gotta go on the fucking bridge. I don't like this part. Oh, I was listening to, um... Oh, <laughs> 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 